get some groceries. I met her down at Althane. She said that she saw me walking in about a mile away. Bean just had to take her phone and I just took her smile away. She said, There's no way. Look at this. There's no way. I forgot we had the speakers. Yeah. Talk to you. I don't want to let you down. Welcome to the Scottsdale Collective. We got 25 people coming out to this event. I'm gonna give you guys a tour of the venue we're gonna be doing the event at. This is gonna be where we do the event at. Hey, what's up to M. Joe? You got here early, so. We got pool table. Yeah, it's pretty sweet. Scottsdale. Yeah. Kitchen. This is where we're gonna be cooking up some breakfast for everybody. We got a living room back here. This big couch to sit down on. A couple people staying in here. Pretty sweet room. Goes right outside in the backyard. And then we got two more people staying in this room. We got two more people staying in here. And then my guy Peter Vanderwall gets his own room because he's a special snowflake. This is where the magic happens. We got 15 people just showed up. We got like five or 10 more people coming. But cigar night, first night, tomorrow morning, 7 a.m. We got basketball. None of these guys ever met each other in person. So it's pretty fun. We're uh, finally getting to take everything that's online in person. NBA 2K, like. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me get back to you, Dan. <laughs> Chopstick came with a large low man. It's the clip in it, nigga. I ain't got no aim. Ball man, pocket to a fresh roll man. And I stay with the cash like an exo chain. You see this guy right here? His name is Matt Shields. I'm about to dog on his ass, so we'll get it. Last play of the game, he's gonna throw me an oop. I'm put my nuts in his face, you see. Nigga pull up, think G.I. Joe, man. 762, turn him G.I. Jack. That Rick Owen boot, they be knee high, man. Now when I look down, you know I can't see my ass. Man, she's good. Just had a great day of intensive training at the venue, and now we just got the Top Golf. We got like 20 people coming out. We got four bays, buffet. It's gonna be fun. So you guys can see me uh, swing a golf club for the third time ever in my life. It'll be fun. Yeah, 21, the biggest. Put a nigga in the chicken wing, pussy. Hold on, I'm a sleeper, bro. I'm a sleeper. He doesn't realize that. Just wait. Wait till you see that swing. 21, can you do something for me? 21. Can you hit a little rich flex for me? Then 21, can you do something for me? Good night. Time to go back and smoke another cigar. 6.50, bright and early. About to go get a workout in. If you guys have seen my client James, dude's probably about two of me wide and two of me tall. So he's about to go lead us in a workout. So, see you there. Metrics, sprint machine, salt bike. I don't usually do bodybuilding stuff, so this is much different. Just finished a killer workout. About to get some coffee, head back to the venue, have some breakfast with everybody, and then the uh, training number two, we're we'll gonna be talking about inbound, how to get more inbound messages on Instagram. So. Hey. Should be good. Hey, I'm to the good life with the COD. Won't even get pulled over in the Yusuf! Yeah. 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 One of the first like modules in that and one of the first things I talked about. Um, 
is this concept of when most people start a business, typically running away from something. They're running away from personal problems, they're running away from mom time, good enough. They're running away from insecurity. And so we're all like running away from these things and we use this as fuel to start. And I do too. But I think eventually, if you want to uh, do what you set out to start to do, which is live your version of a good life, you have to start running towards a vision of the future that you actually can see yourself enjoying. I think instead of running away from things and using that as fuel, you have to find out what is it, what is the life that I actually want to live um, and stop burning fuel that is not endless. Haven't updated in a minute, but we had an amazing training. We talked about how to get more inbound DMs versus outbound, warm outbound. Um, and then after the training, I did a podcast with Matt Shields. Then we watched the Logan Paul fight, missed the KSI one. Then I had a great conversation with one of my clients, and now we're at Fogo the Child, about to get some dinner. Niggas so thirsty to put me in beef. I set in my words and start looking too deep. I look at the tweets and start sucking my teeth. Just know if I diss you, I make sure you know that I hit you like I'm on your call ID. I'm naming the album to fall off. It's pretty ironic because it ain't no fall off for me. Still in this bitch getting bigger. They waiting on the kid. To Woo! Like I'm full, but dinner was really good. Got some steak, got some dessert. Feeling good. Might go smoke another cigar at the venue. Might not. We'll see. I don't know. Tesla versus F type. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> A great night, smoked another cigar, had a wonderful dinner, but we got a hike at 5.30 a.m. We're hiking Pinnacle Peak in Scottsdale. About a mile and a half, but we're doing a sunrise hike. So we're gonna get to the top, have a moment, hike back down, get some breakfast, and then take a nap. I'll see you guys in the morning. My nail tech knows how to keep it a little secret. I don't wish for my success, I speak it. I caught a buzz and you did too, but you tweaking. I look like I've been getting money, how reeky. You smell me, that's LV. Walk around with my chest out and my skin smooth, I'm healthy. I'm in a mix and I'm handshaking, but most of y'all can't help me. Most of y'all ain't wealthy. Just finished a sunrise hike. Just watching the, watching the sunrise come up. You don't get to do it that often. But now I better go to breakfast. That was fucking insane. Dude, that was so badass. That was so freaking fun. Yo. <laughs> That's the car content I've always wanted, bro. <laughs> you were just take. Oh, we felt bad for that Honda in front of you because you were just flooring it and stopping like 10 meters before. <laughs> Last day of the collective, we've got we're about to finish out hot seats. Everybody goes around talk about their offer, what their biggest bottlenecks are, and what they're hoping to get out of the weekend. Then uh, we're gonna chill, crack on a couple pods, and call it a day. I think it's not definitely like it doesn't hurt right to have an SEO because I've gotten a bunch of leads through through YouTube that they're coming from YouTube, not paid ads. Yeah. But I also think that YouTube is just like. If you can, if you could just pay for people on Instagram and nerd swim with YouTube, that would work in itself. And like, <coughs> the YouTube would just kind of like a bonus. Uh. Uh. I love it though. I love it though. <laughs> you know. Uh. Put your hands to the constellations. The way you look should be a sin. You my sensation. <laughs> I know I'm preaching to the congregation. We love Jesus, but you done learned a lot of Selected number one, Scottsdale, Arizona. <laughs> I mean, Nina did a lot of waiting. We ain't married, but tonight I need some consummation. 